Have you ever wondered about the lost towns of the ancient world? As we journey through the annals of history, we often stumble upon these enigmatic places, seemingly erased from existence, only to be rediscovered by the relentless hands of time. These lost towns, once bustling with life, today lie silent, their stories whispered only through the echo of ruins. Yet they continue to captivate us, their mysteries beckoning us to delve deeper into our shared past. They serve as poignant reminders of civilizations long gone, of cultures that shaped our world, and of the relentless march of time that leaves no stone unturned. Every brick, every artifact, every scrap of parchment found in these places holds the potential to rewrite history, to shed light on the forgotten chapters of our story. And so, with a sense of awe and curiosity, let's delve into the intriguing history of three such towns from the Vedic period, Purushapura, Ganda, and Barakpur. Known today as Peshawar, Purushapura was once a thriving hub of ancient civilization. This city, nestled in what is now Pakistan, was a jewel of the Vedic period, a time when knowledge and culture were as valuable as gold and gems. Purushapura was more than just a city. It was a crossroads for traders, scholars, and explorers alike. Its strategic location made it a crucial link in the Silk Road, the legendary trade route that connected the East and the West. This bustling commerce brought not only wealth, but also a fusion of cultures that shaped its unique identity. Over the centuries, Purushapura witnessed the rise and fall of empires, each leaving its mark on the city's rich tapestry. It was through these layers of history that Purushapura transformed from a trade hub into a city with a cultural heritage as diverse as its people. From a bustling trade center to a city with a rich cultural heritage, Purushapura's journey has been truly remarkable. Gandhar, now known as Kandahar, was a city that played a significant role in the ancient world. Situated at the crossroads of major trade routes, this bustling metropolis was the cultural epicenter of the Indian subcontinent during the Vedic period. It was a melting pot of ideas, philosophies and arts, drawing intellectuals from far and wide. Gandhar was renowned for its distinctive art style, a unique blend of Greek and Indian influences, a testament to its cosmopolitan nature. The city was also a beacon of learning, with the Gandhar Mahavihara serving as a prominent center for Buddhist studies. The echoes of Gandhar's cultural prowess can still be felt today, with remnants of its past glory scattered across modern Kandahar. The city's influence extended beyond its borders, shaping the cultural and intellectual landscape of the entire region. Its legacy, woven into the tapestry of history, continues to captivate scholars and history enthusiasts alike. Gandhar's cultural richness and influence have left an indelible mark on the annals of history. Barakpur may be a small town today, but it was once a city of great importance. Nestled in the lap of the Vedic period, it was known as Barakpur, a significant hub of culture and civilization. This city was strategically positioned at the intersection of several major trade routes, making it a bustling center of commerce and exchange. Over the centuries, Barakpur has seen the rise and fall of numerous empires, each leaving behind a distinct fingerprint on its rich tapestry of history. From the Mauryan dynasty's architectural marvels to the Gupta era's intellectual pursuits, the city has been a silent witness to the ebb and flow of time. Despite its transformation into a humble town, the spirit of the ancient city lives on. The old temples, the fading murals, the ancient scriptures, they all whisper tales of its grandeur. The echoes of Barakpur's glorious past can still be heard in its present. These lost towns are not just remnants of the past, they are gateways to understanding our history. In the heart of the Indian subcontinent, Purushapura, once a beacon of ancient glory, has evolved over centuries, bearing witness to the ebb and flow of civilizations. It continues to whisper tales of its past, giving us glimpses into the grandeur of the Maurya and Gupta dynasties. Moving westward, we encounter Gandhar, the cultural epicenter of the ancient world. A melting pot of philosophies and arts, Gandhar served as the crucible for the Gandhara school of art, a testament to the region's rich cultural fabric. 
Further east, Barakpur paints a picture of forgotten grandeur. Once a bustling city, it now holds a mirror to the past, reflecting the vibrant history of the Bengal region. As we explore the mysteries of these lost towns, we are reminded of the ever-changing nature of civilizations and the enduring legacies they leave behind.